A piece of Hawaii's history saved and restored by the Preservation Department of the University of Hawaii at Manoa Hamilton Library. This kapa, native Hawaiian fabric made from certain trees and shrubs, dates as far back as the 1860s. The nine kapa moi, used for sleeping or resting, were damaged in the 2011 Japan tsunami while in storage at the Hulihe'e Palace in Kailua Kona on the island of Hawaii. They're all different and they all sort of represent a broad period of Hawaiian um, kapa making in the 19th century. The Daughters of Hawaii, an organization founded in 1903 to preserve the Hawaiian culture, contracted Hamilton Library to restore the kapa. The couple was kept in a freezer until the project received a grant from FEMA, the Federal Emergency Management Agency. The restoration work began in 2014 and lasted six weeks. Mainly we looked at where it was um, weakest. We've done men's to be sure that it doesn't break down more. Fittingly, the restored couple was first presented at the annual Ho'okele Na'o'ao Librarianship Symposium that aims to promote Hawaiian librarianship and its importance in preserving the Hawaiian culture. One of the kapa on display belonged to Hawaiian royalty, the family of Princess Ruth Ke'eli Kolani. The kapa represents many things to us. It's, it's a cultural expression, it's our tradition, it's our uh, ali'i's kapa. And so it brings with it a lot of mana, and that mana never goes away, never dies. Thanks to the efforts of the UH Manoa Hamilton Library Preservation Department, which is continuously working to restore everything from library books to historical artifacts like old maps, and, in this case, 19th century kapa.